Well, Kanye's album Donda is finally out, and people were surprised because nobody thought it was going to drop until next week. There's been so many delays. But Kanye posted that this uh, Universal put my album out without my approval, and they blocked Jail 2 from being on the album. That's cap. You know, damn well Universal ain't put that album out without his approval. I remember last week, at, at some point last week, you reported that the album was dropping on a Sunday. Yeah, I mean, there were a few different days. They actually had it, I think, for next week. Then they said it was the third. Then they said it was coming out on the fifth. There was just all kinds of confusion. But I remember they said it was coming out right after he had this last listening session. Exactly. And his whole team, in, including Booze, part of his management, was were tweeting about the album when it dropped. So, right. They were even they even were posting the process like, oh, just no. turned it into such and such. Like, stop, Kanye. Kanye That's cap. is a clown. He is a clown oh. in a okay, circus. Okay, Envy. He is a oh. clown in a circus, and I'm ashamed of the people around him. Boo, Free, Pusha, Monopoly, he is a clown. And if you don't get your guy together, like Charlemagne said seven years ago, when he came up here and said, the people around you don't love you. And Kanye, <laughs> the people around you don't love you. You are a clown. I'm and sending we Kanye take it back, healing energy. And we take it back to what, what you would say in South Carolina. You need to get boxed in the malt. You I'm are sending a clown. Kanye healing what? energy envy. You are a clown, sending... and the people around you are clowns if they don't check you. You are a clown. I'm sending Kanye West healing energy, but I agree with you. <laughs> <laughs> clown. All I definitely right. agree with him about his people. It's a lot of people who enable a lot of toxic behavior from Kanye West. A lot of people. If and my friends all, around me don't all check y'all me, y'all are enablers. Yeah. If, if my friends around don't check me when I do stupidish, I'm their clowns too. And if I ever did some clownish. I, I, my friends would check me. Charlemagne would check me. Ye would check me. You but let's talk about clowns. it. Clowns. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> it's not our story to talk. Tell. But I would love That's to. Right. Oh, I was talking about you. Oh. <laughs> All right. Now, <laughs> it was a joke. All right. Now, Kanye is on the way to break the record for the most number one albums on the Billboard 200 among artists debuting on the charts. So it looks like uh, that has happened because he is number one. Did y'all listen to the album? How did y'all feel about it? I'm not listening yeah, I mean, to that, it's 27, circus, that clown circus. It's, it's 27 songs, so it's a lot to inge- to digest. Did you listen yeah, to it, Charlamagne? Are you going to support Kanye? Yeah, I did. I listened to it yesterday. Um, mm-hmm. I, I, I don't know if it's lackluster or too long. Maybe both. You know, a point first mm-hmm. listen for me, it was just, it was kind of lackluster and long. An hour and 48 minutes is, is nuts. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's like, like a double album. album. Yeah, even without That's all the part is. twos it's a double on album. there. It's, yeah, even without all the part twos on there, it's just still too long. And it, and it gets exhausting. And the music, to me, sounds kind of dated. Like Kanye's flow and his 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 sound kind, it sound kind of dated. The album was all right, but I, I wasn't blown away. A point of first list. Terms. When's Drake album coming out? September 3rd. Hey, We're going to get to that next. Yeah. Right. We're going to get to that in the next hour. But yes, it is coming out September 3rd. You got dates for Kendrick, too? <laughs> for Kendrick? That's the album. I don't think we got for. no date for Kendrick. Drake All and Kendrick. I know is Kanye sent Justin LeBoy on a dummy mission for three weeks straight with wrong release dates and couldn't even give him the right release date Not for this all. weekend. Come on, man. Not at all. That's, I tell you, he's a clown, man. Now you start looking at him, you look at that stupid jacket he's been wearing. That's a clown jacket. That's a clown outfit. Them stupid ass sneakers. Those are clown sneakers. Send Kanye West healing energy. Stop. All right. Send him healing energy, man. All right. All right. We just talked this morning about how you don't know what people are going through. That's right. Send the brother healing energy. Yeah, but man. it's also the people around you that should check you when you do some stupid ish, even no matter what you're going through. I do agree. No matter what you're going through, it doesn't give you the license to um, abuse people. That's right. Be disrespectful. People. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes yeah, I, I, I think I think some people times you just need to get punched in the face a couple of times. One good one good time. Just blood, little bloody the mouth a little bit. Not hurt nobody. We don't, we don't encourage punch? anybody punching Did someone in the face. Did you just say you want to punch Kanye West in the mouth? I didn't. We say don't that. encourage I that. Said Monday sometimes, morning. Yeah, sometimes you need that. Absolutely. Let when people get disrespectful, <laughs> yes, you need to bloody their mouth sometimes. I I I agree. Let me get some breakfast first before I have this conversation with you <laughs> in front of millions of people. <laughs> okay. Yo, unless you've been living under a rock, man, the rap game is like WWE right now. It's just crazy. You don't never know what to expect, man. And DJ Envy coming out, man, talking about Kanye is a clown and need to be punched in the mouth. Oh, man, this is completely crazy, dog. For one, he ain't going to do it. Two, I think I kind of find it real funny. The envy is saying there's a lot of clown ish going on with Kanye, considering what the Breakfast Club be having going on. I mean, man, let's just be real here, man. Wasn't it just not too long ago Charlemagne was passing out booties? 
if we want to talk about clowns and circus acts, I mean, let's be real here, man. The Breakfast Club is known for being the circus. We done seen everything from multiple six nine interviews, from Birdman and Soldier Boy coming in that acting a fool. If we looking for some drama, we know where to find it. And Breakfast Club is one of them places, man. They know what to say to get people riled up. They always asking the wrong questions and trying to act like they don't know what people talking about. Just last week, they was interviewing Boosie and trying to make him to be the bad guy. When in fact, they know exactly what point he was trying to make. So come on, let's keep it real, man. But anyways, let me know how y'all feel in the comments. I know I ain't tripping. So let me know how y'all feel about it. I need a second opinion.